Today I'm going to demonstrate how to fillet a uh, black drum. A uh, black drum in the size range from 16 to 27 inches, slot drum as they're called, have a very tender, white, flaky, excellent quality meat uh, that's often used as a substitute in restaurants for redfish since the commercial ban on redfish took place uh, in the 1990s. Uh, redfish and, and black drum are close relatives and the meat of these slot drum as they're called is very high quality tender and tasty. Uh, the knives I use is I use a, a six inch a special 119 buck knife to separate the fillet uh, from the backbone and then I use a sharp uh, Dexter Russell uh, seven inch fillet knife to separate the meat from the skin. The first cut I'm going to make is separating the fillet from the rib cage through here and then the second cut I make separates the fillet from the backbone through here. So you want to get a firm grip with your left hand and always work the knife away from the hand that you're holding the fish with. So I'm just feeling my way along kind of the backbone backbone at the bottom and the rib cage through here to make the first cut separating the fillet from the rib cage and this cut completes it then I kind of neaten it up a little bit then I come through to separate the fillet uh, completely from the backbone All right, and that's a much easier and simpler technique. A lot of people like to use uh, electrical, electric knives and stouter blades and do a lot of sawing and cutting action to actually open up the rib cage. That's a little messier. Once you have the fillet separated from the backbone, the next step is to, I like to get a good grip up at the front of the fillet with pliers and then use a sharp Dexter Russell fillet knife to separate the fillet from the skin and I'm pulling as hard with the pliers in the left hand as I am pushing with the fillet knife uh, in the right hand to complete the separation uh, from the backbone. Okay, the next side requires some similar motion but things are kind of reversed with the left and right hand. You want to make sure that you're always pushing away with the blade from the hand that you're supporting the fish with. So work it in there. First make you cut along the rib cage. Finish it up a little bit, neaten it up a tad. And then make the cut along the backbone. In with the pliers, start from the front, work the fillet knife and separate the skin from the fillet and then we have two very nice uh, black drum fillets that can be used for uh, black and red fish or any other favorite Louisiana uh, fish dish that you would ordinarily make with red fish of a comparable size very high quality white flaky meat Ooh, that's gonna be good <laughs>